The 2023 Land Rover Defender combines on-road prowess with off-road prowess, while being comfortable in almost any situation. What kind of car is the Land Rover Defender 2023? The 2023 Land Rover Defender is an all-terrain-based SUV with an impressive road surface. Trade it up against the smaller Jeep Wrangler and Ford Bronco, plus maybe the Mercedes-Benz G-Class. Is the Land Rover Defender 2023 a good SUV? Combining outstanding off-road capability, unique style and excellent on-road comfort, the Land Rover Defender is a brilliant toy. It can be expensive, though. We recommend the 2023 Defender with 6.4 out of 10. What's new for the 2023 Land Rover Defender? For 2023, the Defender lineup grows, naturally, with the addition of a long-legged model with three rows of seats called 130. Otherwise, the door 90 and the middle 110 get an 11.4-inch touchscreen and see some tweaks in their option package. Retro with no old-school details, the Defender is a high-tech take on the classic Land Rover model from 1948. His punchline evokes a bygone era, while shortcuts take full advantage of his power. The big wheels, LED headlights and lack of external rings show little in common with the car that has worn the Defender logo for the better part of four decades. Inside, it plays without much Jeep Wrangler kitsch. The boxy style offers plenty of space and, in keeping with modern Land Rover tradition, there's no shortage of luxury features available. The Defender draws a line between utility and extravagance, it will not be good for you to make it dirty, but you will be happy if it is cleaned again. The lineup starts with a 296 horsepower 2.0 liter turbo 4 before moving from a 395 horsepower turbo 6 to a 518 horsepower supercharged V8. No one is particularly aggressive, although the mid-level six-cylinders mild hybrid technology top 20 miles per gallon combined. Four-wheel drive is standard, of course, and a two-speed manual transmission comes in handy for tough jobs. The choice of air suspension provides greater ground clearance at the touch of a button, while the electronic locking differential at the rear is essential to improve traction quickly. Even with its off-road credentials, the Defender controls the road. The external vision is not a plus, but it is fast, quiet and confident, especially in the air source. How much does the 2023 Land Rover Defender cost? Base starts at around $55,000, although models with a six-cylinder engine can easily exceed $70,000. Good standard fare, large touchscreen, power-adjustable front seats and plenty of active safety technology. Differential lock and air suspension are optional and highly recommended for off-road use. Land Rover Defender 2023 Style It's not as fun or as retro as the Ford Bronco, but the 2023 Land Rover Defender upholds the brand's heritage without any kitsch. Both box types get one point above average, as the interior is beautiful. The Defender is 7 on our scale. Land Rover builds the Defender in small, 90, medium, 110, and large, 130, lengths, although those numbers don't match its wheelbases. In fact, the 110 and 130 share a 110.9-inch wheelbase. They all wear similar livery, including a blocky front end with a rectangular headlight with a rounded shape. The checkerboard on the cover looks like it should provide a good grip, although it's actually plastic and is pretty much unbreakable. Land Rover offers a wide range of colors, including different body parts and larger wheels. Shop carefully to get the best security guard in your area. Inside, it looks like an advanced Lego set, with lots of storage and trunks. Clothing comes standard, but most will use full or partial leather. Synthetic leather is a new option to consider if you plan to get the best out of your Defender. 2023 Land Rover Defender Performance The Land Rover Defender 2023 is a great all-rounder that is perfect for touring. The Land Rover Defender 2023 is worth its high price tag considering its wide range of capabilities. Its comfortable ride and remote capabilities each earn it points. It's a 7 for efficiency. Is the Land Rover Defender 4WD? Obviously, the Land Rover accepts a lower limit and more models on the road. You have to pay for knobby tires, an air suspension that improves ground clearance, a rear differential, an additional traction control system, and the automaker's off-road cruise control system that ride at a low speed while walking getting worse. The comfort and convenience of the Land Rover Defender 2023. The interior of the 2023 Defender is pleasant, with good comfort for the occupants of the first two rows in addition to a large cargo capacity. It is an 8 on the TCC scale. Although Land Rover has a choice of three rows in the front row, this cabin has character. Front seat occupants have comfortable padded seats with standard light switches. Rear drivers have good access in the four-door model to a bench seat with good legroom. The 5 plus 2 third row on the Defender 110 is useless though. Opt for the Defender 130 instead, which has three seatbelts and enough space for a third child or adult. Different cargo spaces. The Defender 90s has only 15.6 cubic feet behind the second row, 
while the 110s takes it to 34.0 cubic feet. The Defender 130 offers just 13.7 cubic feet behind the third row, which expands to 43.5 cubic feet with the third row down. Maximum cargo capacity ranges from 58.3 cubic feet and 90 cubic feet in 79 in 110 to nearly 81 cubic feet in 130. The material is always good, even with rubber floors and cloth seats in cheap models. High-end models with beautiful leather and open would look as chic as the old Range Rover. How safe is the Land Rover Defender? We can't say for sure because it hasn't been tested by IIHS or NHTSA. Given its relatively small market share compared to, say, the Ford Explorer, the 2023 Defender can't rank well. However, it comes with good security technology. You'll find automatic emergency braking, blind spot monitoring, active lane control, parking sensors and a surround camera system on all trims, while adaptive cruise control is available everywhere. Features of the Land Rover Defender 2023 Land Rover currently offers three Defender body styles, each with a range of available features and powertrains. We consider recently 8 out of 10 overall thanks to good standard equipment, a large, sophisticated touchscreen infotainment system and seemingly endless options. A 4-year per 50,000-mile warranty is standard for the luxury segment, but does not include free maintenance. Start your Defender hunt by narrowing down 18 base models based on how many doors and seats you need. The cheapest model is actually the middle child, Defender 110 in base S trim with 18-inch wheel, adjustable front seats, 10.0-inch touchscreen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility, automatic emergency braking, spot monitors, active traffic control and a surround camera system for $54,975. Although we like the idea of the basis of the basic look with steel wheels, the middle level S opens up other options and can be configured in all three models. The S adds 19-inch alloy wheels, leather upholstery, and a Meridian-branded audio system. It costs $56,575 as a short-legged Defender 90, $59,475 as a Defender 110, or $69,475 as a Big Boy 130. Which Land Rover Defender should I buy? It depends on what you are looking for. The Defender 110 model has a small design that works as a good platform for those who are out and about. Add adaptive cruise control, a locking rear differential, air suspension and the Terrain 2 response package and you'll bump the price to $60,075. It takes a six-cylinder to deliver maximum performance, so you'll have to step up to the SE model. The 90 SE Defender costs $70,775 to start, but you can add cooled seats, wood trim, a mini fridge and other niceties. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future. Thank you. Comment down what next review you guys want, see you guys in next video and thanks for watching.